Thank you so much viewer for choosing my video and today I will discuss about VLD 280 display blinking issue solutions. You can see the picture of blinking, VLD blinking issues. So this is the main common thing to VLD 280 display series and the continue blinking. So for the reasons, so pro production will be disrupted and the system will be disrupted. So I'm just open this VLD for open connections, all the connections and VLD is the base the VFD is uh, installing here so then this is the beside VFD uh, this is the you know so there's a VFD main MCB in the left side left one I'm just open for safety purpose and then close the video uh, main power this is the all of the connections this is the VFD body frame I, I need to open otherwise how I solve these problems I, I need to repair of the VFD because Without repair, the display is not the corrections. So this is the VFD body frame. You can see the picture. This is the nameplate of the VFD. So main uh, important is thing that uh, the 5.5 kilowatt and 7.5 ASP capacity of this VFD. So if you are first in my channel, please subscribe my channel. Also, see this video from the starting to end. Otherwise, you cannot understand really properly. So you can see this is the I'm just open all the cover of this VFD and I will discuss you the VFD blinking issue arise only for the purse. You know this is the four capacitor. I'm just mentioning you the finger and one, two, three, four, four capacitor. The this is the main culprit of this display control board. So you can see the picture and very carefully and the attentively you know the capacitor and a top point is the fader like the fade is going to the damage so for the reasons the capacity nor is storage the charge so for the display is continue blinking you know this is the capacitor leg i'm just mentioned in the thing or my finger two leg capacitor this is the uh, capacity of this capacitor is 35 volt dc and 220 microfarad this is the all over the vfd this is the 5.5 kilowatt capacity in your factory, you have the similar series VLT2800. This is the communication scale, uh, similar series VLT. So, if, if the if the happen in this problem, the display blinking conditions, you, you never change the VFD. You just change only for four capacitor. After that, the, this VFD is completely okay. You will be the completely okay. This is the main control card. I just I just show you. I'm just not working here because my my concern is only for the four pieces of capacitor. I'm just showing you. This is the control card. Uh, this is the uh, main control card connection point. The control connection point. This is the uh, relay connection points, and this is the USB points. So for communicate with the VFD to the laptop. This is the main control panels. Main control card. I'm just showing you. I have no work in here. I'm just mentioning that this is the control card. And this is the display you can see this is the display I'm just covering up this and that this is the control connection point if I mentioned that it's the full completely and the VLD 2800 series this is the Danforce and the display you can see the picture in here and very carefully I'm just I just want to just connect with the this is the connector communications cable from main circuit board to the control circuit board communications cable I just put in here you can see this is the connection point yes this is the connection point main circuit board to the main control card board and you can see this is the uh, the capacitor I just I just open this now I just open it four pieces of capacitor this is the all over the VFD inside the VFD what is this power in available in, in this part in this VFD you can see the picture this is my concern is only for full capacitor at this this four capacitors I just now just I just open and the for tools required for the open capacitor soldering iron and the soldering lead these two tools are required for this open the capacitor okay I'm just open now start the open i am just not showing you the how i open this because video will be longer so for the so you can see the picture in here i just already open this the full capacitor already open the capacitor one two three four 
I, I'm not showing you because uh, if I want to show the video, so the it will be, video will be longer. So, so for the reason, I'm just not showing you. So you can see the my capacitor in my hand, the capacitor 35 volt DC and 2 to 0 micro cap shredder capacitors. Four pieces capacitor I just replaced, and this is the brand of Ipcos brand, very good brand. This is inbuilt from the VFD. Yes, I just opened all the four capacitor. Now I just putting the four capacitor. This is the old capacitor. I just throw out all the capacitor from my factory. And this is the new capacitor. You can see this is the new capacitor. Yes, I just purchased this from the only for very uh, cool, uh, less price. This is the only for 3.5 taka in BDT. This is the new capacitor. I just put in capacitor similar capacities, the 35 volt DC and the 2 to oh, 0 microfarad. I just opened four capacitor and old and new just four pieces in, in uh, fix in the BMD. After that, it will be completely working perfectly. You can see the picture in here. This is the now working perfectly. If you have in in this system in your plan, you just open the four capacitor and just replace the four capacitor. That then after completing everything is working well. Thank you.